So let's talk about eye contact and how our eyes are communicating and influencing the way that we interact with people. So if this is the first time that we meet, I'm Jonas Erb and on this channel we talk about authenticity and personal growth. We provide tools and ideas that help you gain clarity, freedom and fulfillment in your life. If you haven't yet, consider subscribing just down here. So let's talk about our eyes and eye contact. It's really interesting to see that the way that we communicate with our eyes, how we look at someone really interact, really impacts the way that we communicate. And so we actually say that the eyes are the mirror of the soul. And it's really interesting to get more aware of what are our eyes doing and what are other people's eyes doing and seeing that they are an integral part of communication and interaction. And so what I want to show you today is I want to show you two things and they're related, on, uh, related to how I um, am communicating with my eyes. So the first thing is that there is this with your eyes, you can be very like penetrative, like very much like this, then you can be very much just relaxed inside of yourself or you can be kind of trying to hide, hide behind yourself. And so I want to show you how that feels like. And then for you to invite you to see how or may like how you do that in your life and when you do that. And the second thing I want to talk about is being having warm eyes or cold, cold eyes. And just see how that influences the way that you communicate with people. So the first thing, if you're really penetrative, it could, could look something like that. And it might be hard for you to see in the camera. But so basically, this is kind of like the feeling of like very penetrative eyes. It's kind of like it's dominant. It's kind of like invading the space of the other person. It's very, you know, it's very focused. It's very much like I'm full here. And um, but it's also kind of like almost a little bit aggressive. And then you kind of just being relaxed and just being open without being like forward or backward, just being kind of like open. will probably look more a little bit like that. It's just kind of kind and open. Have you guys just be just if, if, if a penetrative was if like this um, strong penetrative was in front, this one would be just in the middle of my body. Just kind of relaxed and open. And then hiding would be something like that. And kind of like trying to not show too much of myself and kind of like hiding and not showing my soul through my eyes. Just not showing myself. I'm not sure if this translates through the camera, but that's kind of like the feeling. And what I would invite you to do is to see what are you like, which kind of state of your eyes are you in usually or in, other, in some kind of situations. And all of these kind of ways of behaving with your eyes might have their specific situation, but they're really useful. But just being aware, maybe when are you hiding? Maybe when are you hiding and you realize you wouldn't actually want to hide? You would just want to be more open. Or when do you have to say something very strong to someone and you might ha have maybe more of like a penetrative way of looking at people. Um, and maybe you just explore that a little bit and see what happens. And also see with other people, how are they looking at you? And then the second one, the second part is really feeling this openness or having like open warm eyes, warm eyes or like cold eyes. So warm eyes would be something like that. It's almost like as if I was smiling with my eyes. It's just being very warm. And just see maybe explore when you're walking in the streets or when you're sitting in a restaurant or just see what happens if you have warm eyes. 
how are people going to interact or look at you if you have warm eyes? This is kind of how it would look like if warm eyes. And now if I close, kind of like have cold eyes, it would look more something like that. Kind of just closing down. So I'm opening again. And so I'm not sure, really not sure if that translates, but um, let me know in the comments. Do you see what I mean? Do you see what I'm talking about? And so just for you to explore the invitation is really to explore and see when do you have open warm, warm eyes and when you have cold eyes. And what is, what is communicated when you do that? What happens when you are with your friends or with someone that you don't know? Do you have warm eyes generally or do you have cold eyes? And what about when you're walking in the streets? How are other people looking at you? Do you have warm eyes? Do they have cold eyes? What about you? And what happens maybe if you have warm eyes and you're kind of smiling, maybe the other person is smiling back. Maybe if you have cold eyes, everyone is looking at you or not uh, looking away or, or kind of like, you know, scared or don't look into your eyes. Maybe because you have cold eyes. Um, and just, I invite you to explore those, um, you know, states of, of how you use your, how, how your eyes are communicating. And it's less about wanting to have one or the other way of looking with your eyes, but it's more about exploring how are my eyes influencing the way that I interact with people and how are other people communicating with their eyes? How am I communicating and just being more aware of what's going on. Because usually when I have cold eyes, it's because of something that's going on inside of myself. And if I can just, you know, maybe accept that and let go of that, I can, I might be able to open my eyes again. Or if I realize how I'm looking at someone, then I realize what's going on inside of myself. Same with this penetrative or just open or like hiding. Just being aware, when, for example, where am I hiding? Or when am I trying to like be very penetrative, but maybe it's not the right uh, you know, it doesn't suit the situation. Just being very curious about what's going on with my eyes. This is the invitation of this video. So if you liked the video, please hit the like button and let me know in the comments if you saw that and if you wanted to see more of those videos. It's, um, I think it's difficult to kind of like explain those kind of things that are more kind of like an, an energetic thing. Um, but it's really uh, something that I've found to be very powerful. Uh, and just exploring myself and, and what's happening in, 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 in communication with other people. So let me know if you like that. And um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel to see more of those videos. And maybe you want to watch um, some more of, uh, videos right now. And this one is the one that YouTube thinks you would like the most. And this one is my most recent video. So have fun watching and have a great day. Goodbye, everyone.